I don't know why I'm doing this. This is magical. Hello friends and welcome to another magical unboxing. So I have to share this with you guys because this was pretty funny. I was actually recording another video but then the doorbell rang and it is my package from Magical Suitcase. So of course I dropped everything and now we're going to unbox one of the two boxes that I ordered from Magical Suitcase. For those of you who don't know Magical Suitcase, I will leave their website in the description down below. Definitely go check them out because I personally think that they are one of the best Harry Potter boxes at the moment. I also have a discount code for you guys. Just use my first name, Leanda, to get 5% off your purchase. Not only do they have magical Harry Potter boxes, they also have boxes from different fandoms like The Witcher or Disney. And I have ordered another box from them, the Mulan box, which you can guess is <laughs> themed around Disney's Mulan. So that will be my next unboxing on this channel. But for today, we will be unboxing their Harry Potter box. It is the April box themed around the golden trio, Harry, Ron, and Hermione. So you can imagine, I am just super excited and super curious to see what kind of items they come up with. Because let me tell you, the last box that I got from them was just amazing. I got an entire potions kit. So go watch that video. I guarantee you that you're, it's gonna make you happy. If you like these kind of magical unboxings, then don't forget to click that subscribe button and hit that bell so you never miss another video of me again. Now let's get unboxing. And here I have the Golden Trio box. We have Hermione, Harry and Ron standing in front of Hogwarts and we can see an owl here and here and it's just a beautiful sticker. I'm not really sure what Ron is holding in his hand here but other than that they just make the box a little bit more magical so I love that they do this. Okay guys let's take our first peek. I am so excited. <laughs> Okay. I think that's the spoiler sheet, so no harm done. Oh, there's black tissue paper. <laughs> Let's remove the black tissue paper so I can give you guys a second sneak peek. And this is how that looks. I think I see another pop. I can see a pin, two big white boxes. Oh, yeah. I don't know where to start. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna be bold here and I'm just gonna start with one of these big white boxes. Let's see. Okay. Ooh, maybe, I think it's one of their candles. Oh, if you guys been watching my other unboxings for Magical Suitcase, you know I absolutely love their candles. Um, and this is the Hogwarts Express. And beneath it, it says sweets from Trolley Witch. I wonder how that would smell. Let's take a look at the inside. Yeah, what did I say? These look amazing. Oh, it kind of smells like, like chocolate chip cookies. Yeah, it definitely smells like chocolate chip cookies. Okay, now I'm hungry. And I'm actually one of those people that don't buy candles for themselves, so I'm always very happy when I get them in my magical subscription boxes. Okay, good start. Let's see what the next item is. I have a paper brown bag and it feels soft. Is this a t-shirt? Yeah, I think it's a t-shirt. Yeah, let's see what is on there. Oh, what does it say? <laughs> Why is it that whenever anything happens, it's always you three? That is such a cool t-shirt for this theme. I like this t-shirt. I like the quote that they use, that it's black and white, and the design with Deathly Hallow signs and the two broomsticks, that's very cute. I have to say though, their t-shirts are quite big, so normally I have a size medium, but for their boxes, I order a size small, which is no problem at all, but do be aware of that when you order Order your own box. I've already seen the next item and I am very excited about that one because some of you might know that I also love pops. You can see some of them standing on my shelves and there is a Funko Pop inside this box and it's from Hermione and it looks 
absolutely amazing. It is pop number 77 and it is Hermione in her cat form when she just drank the polyjuice potion. And this is a pop that I don't have so I am very excited about this one. Uh, at the back you can always see the collection that the pop belongs to. Um, so I actually have this one and this one. I'm doing pretty good. Let me get this pop out of the box. This might be my new favorite pop, guys. I mean, this just looks amazing. She has her Slytherin robes on her wands. And at the back, even a, a little tail. Yeah, this, this looks great. I just think it's so great that Magical Suitcase includes Funko Pops. I mean, they do this in almost every box. And let me tell you, Pops are not that cheap. They go from between 12 to maybe 20 euros, so that they include one in almost every box, I think it's just great. The next item in this box is, ooh, the tea. This is something they include in every box, and this time we got a tea called Allery. And this tea contains pure, pure, I don't know how to pronounce that <laughs> and I don't know what it is actually um, cherry and grapefruit birdweed it sounds interesting but does it smell good it smells good and I just think their teas always look very natural and I have to say they taste very good as well I am very happy that we got another one because I'm a tea drinker and a coffee drinker by the way I drink both but yeah I love getting tea Why am I talking so much? What do we go for next? Let's go for the paper brown bag. Oh, it's very heavy. What could this be? Is it a potion? It's Polyjuice Potion. <laughs> that is so cute. It's Polyjuice Potion. There's a very beautiful label on front. I really love the colors that they used and the design. And I believe that this is something we can use because you can open it. So what is this? Oh, it's hand care oil. That is very innovative. <laughs> but it looks like Polyjuice Potion. That is so cool. Okay. It smells very musky, like very heavy. Okay, so let's try a little bit on my skin. Ooh, that's a lot. Mmm, <laughs> okay. <laughs> Ooh, that's very oily. Look at that. <laughs> okay, I'm just gonna rub it out now. So now there's gonna be oil all over my items. Oh, I do hope this smells good because <laughs> it's all over my hands now. Oh, it actually does. It smells a lot better when it's on your skin. It smells a bit like chocolate frog, but maybe that's just me. I think it smells a bit like chocolate frog. It's actually really nice and it feels really good on your skin. And even if you're not a fan of hand care oil, I mean, you can just use it as a display item because this label is super cute. Okay, next up is another licensed item, I believe. But what is it? Oh, it's a 3D keychain. That is interesting. It is a little elder wand with a Deathly Hello sign next to it. That is so adorable. <laughs> I am definitely gonna use this. I never saw these. This is pretty hilarious. Like, can you imagine me in my car? Because I actually have a bit of road rage, so I curse sometimes when I'm in my car and people annoy me. And now I can just grab my little elder wand and I can curse people with my wands. What do we have here? Is this the will of Albus Percival Wolfric Brian Dumbledore? Look at that guys. This looks awesome and there's a wax seal here and when we open it That is amazing. I love this. This is the last will and testament of Albus Percival Wolfrey Brian Dumbledore. Oh my gosh. First to Ronald Billius Weasley, I leave my Deluminator. 
to Miss Hermione Jane Granger. I leave my copy of The Tales of Beetle the Bard to Harry James Potter. I leave the snitch. And behind that is a paper that says, being of sound mind, I devise following properties to Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry. And then there's also the list of other people that he leaves something to. So for instance, Severus Snape or Slughorn, Newt Commander, and also Gellert Grindelwald. This looks really authentic. And maybe I sound crazy, but it even smells like a will. Ooh, I have a little package, and this almost reminds me of the Philosopher's Stone. What could this... It is! <laughs> I think this is soap. Yeah, <laughs> that is so awesome. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm so enthusiastic sometimes. <laughs> It is Philosopher's Stone Soap. So here you can see the ingredients of the Philosopher's Stone Soap. And the soap itself actually looks really cool. This is such a fantastic idea. I absolutely love this. It smells great. It looks great. It, it resembles the actual Philosopher's Stone. And it even came in this beautiful brown package with a little string. I, yeah, I love this. As I said in the beginning, there are two white boxes. So now I am going to open the second one. Could this be a mug? It is a mug. Let's see. It's a Gryffindor mug. So we got two lions and then in the center you have a scroll which says Gryffindor. You might belong in Gryffindor where dwell the brave at heart. Their daring nerve and chivalry set Gryffindors apart. This sorting hat. I actually really like this design. I just wish it was from Ravenclaw but I'm pretty sure they chose Gryffindor because of the golden trio. But now that I think of it, my boyfriend actually got sorted into Gryffindor, so I am just gonna give this mug to him. There's also a pin inside this box, and their pins are actually made from wood, which is rather unique. And this one is Felix Felicis. I am not the biggest fan of their pins. I do prefer enamel and soft enamel pins, but I like that they are trying something different. And that leaves us with the last item, guys. There are always so many items in these boxes. Uh, but the last item is something made out of paper, and I think this is their spell page. Yes, it is Expecto Patronum which is one of my favorite spells. And here it says the incantation, the movement that you need to make, and there's a little bit of information. I think they do a terrific job of making these spell pages look old and magical. And one of my YouTube friends, Jesse, actually gave me a great idea to collect all these spell pages together and make my own spell book. And those are all the items in the Golden Trio box. So let's take a quick look at the spoiler sheet. Harry, Ron, and Hermione are most probably the most recognizable trio of friends of all series we know. Their adventures accompany successive generations of young wizards and witches. This box will be so Gryffindor themed. <laughs> That's why they put in a Gryffindor mug. We will visit Auri with a cup of delicious tea, we'll peek into the sweets trolley in Hogwarts Express, and we're also going to read the last will of Albus Dumbledore. And then there's a list of all the 11 items that we got in this box. Honestly guys, it is always so hard to choose a favorite item from these boxes because I love the majority of the items. I mean, the will of Albus Dumbledore, the Philosopher's Stone soap, the candle, the Funko Pop, the keychain. Yeah, I'm just naming every item. That's not gonna work. <laughs> um, if you do have a favorite item, please let me know in the comments down below. However, I do have a least favorite item, and that is the wooden pin. I just wish that maybe they choose a different theme because the last three or four wooden pins were all potions, or maybe just do something else with these pins or choose a different design but that is of course personal preference and that was it guys i hope you enjoyed this video if you did then please give it a thumbs up i upload every tuesday or friday so i hope to see you guys soon thank you so much for watching and let's stay in touch